What is up, gamers and flamer? What is up, flamer McBame? During the intermission of last episode and this episode, I've been done. I've. Uh, I. I've been doing some grinding work, and I have uh, gotten a bunch of ender chests, which is really good. And I can store all my valuable things in here. And I got this, which is very cool. And as you can see, I got some, like, armor going. Very, very epic. And I got three netherite scrap from Gabriel, which is very good. I still hold on to this because I, like, never wear it. But that's, that's, that's fine. I got some diamonds. This is really important. Because this is the coordinates to the gunpowder farm made by It's Grand when he gave me it back in like episode 3 because I gave him like eggs. I'd say that's a pretty good deal, at least on my part. I can use that gum powder to make TNT with sand and I have a ton of sand so I can make a ton of TNT, which is really good for getting netherite. So yeah, that's really good. And Pro Timothy gave me a warm welcome with all these crazy things. So I'm I'm like literally rich now. Oh, yeah, that's pretty epic things are going great I am happy doing videos again people are starting to enjoy the videos again. It is very cool stuff Oh, yeah, it's all coming together now. I guess it's only fair that I give uh, pro Timothy a shout out So yeah shout out to pro Timothy link in description you can go check him out He makes thumbnails for the Taz crafters specifically Augie and Gabriel uh, yeah, he is a cool member of the community. You should go subscribe to him because he gave me a lot of cool stuff because he's such a kind and generous man. But now that I have a bunch of these diamonds, what I can do is I can actually buy an elytra for 16 diamonds. I fully enchanted all the enchantments you could possibly need on elytra for just 16 diamonds. I say just because I have a bunch of diamonds now. But yeah. That's, that's what's gonna happen, and once I do that, I can fly around, and it's gonna be very, very cool. Well, using this one netherite he gave me, I'm gonna, or netherite ingot, I'm gonna make a netherite pickaxe, and oh yes, feels so good. I was able to go to the enderman farm and, like, revive all my pickaxes, now I have three pickaxes, only two of them I use though, but yeah. It is very good stuff. Man, it feels so good having it in their chest. It took me 12 episodes, which is which is kind of kind of an oof. <laughs> I forgot to mention netherite tools and armor and just netherite stuff in general does not burn in lava. So there should be no more losing my gear in lava, which is good. Alright, it is time to buy the very epic elytra. Here we go. Alright, moment of truth. Oh, feels so good to have an Elytra. I say that every time I die and have to get a new Elytra, but it, it really does feel good. Even if I do fall off this ledge, at least I can like glide off instead of fall like straight down. And also I could do this, which is very, very helpful. It makes things a lot faster. Two thousand years later. Now that I have my rockets, I'm probably going to keep them inside this, you know, little ender chest, which will be very, very helpful. So I'll always have rockets on me as long as I have my ender chest on me. Very, very useful stuff. And, oh, it feels so good to fly around. Uh-oh, uh-oh. What? Oh, no. How did that happen? Uh, okay. That's not good. That's, that's not good. I uh, think, good thing is, I actually have all this now. So, yeah. Take that stupid, stupid zombie. There's always a twist. Like, every time something good happens, like, it has to get messed up. Or has to get a road blocked. Whether that be a husk or me dying in lava or whatever. Stupid husk. Stupid husk! Stupid husk! No! No, please don't burn my stuff in lava. Do not. Do not. Uh. 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 Let me cover this. Let me cover this. Can't do that! Can't do that! No! No, do not burn my... 
Uh, uh, uh. Wait. Okay, my elytra's still good. Thank Jesus. Because, oh man. I lost a... Well, I still have the gold helmet, but I lost diamond helmet, diamond legging... Oh my... Uh, I'm gonna grab this book and then fly to the epic farm and get some epic gunpowder. Alright, we are at uh, Grand's AFK room and the creeper gunpowder farm. So, yeah, I'm gonna AFK here and just see what happens. Well, turns out I didn't even need to AFK because there's already a crap ton of gunpowder. Oh, oh. Oh, does that give you anxiety? Oh, does that give you anxiety? Does that give you anxiety? <gasps> I got a lot of TNT right here, which is very good. And now it's time to start blasting. All right, well, here goes nothing. Oh, oh lag, lag, lag. Oh, it sure blew up. Okay, there's a lot of lava. Didn't really think about that. Oh, yeah, I did not think about that. Oh, I see one. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, right there. Okay. Let's, let's get up and around. Oh, here we go. This is it. Ancient debris. Right, how much is here? Okay, just two. Wait, I don't have inventory. Oh, okay. Yeah. Alright, light it. Alright, should be good. Hopefully. 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 Is this burning lava? No, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna test that. Okay, I got it. Alright, we have now gotten three netherite scrap. And I also have this netherite scrap. Here we go. We can make a netherite ingot. And unfortunately, I only got one because you need four of these. And you also need four gold. And I can keep this. Save it for later. And now we go to the smithing table. We add our... Netherite ingot to the diamond item of choice, and bam! Got netherite leggings now. <laughs> Look super cool, lit, fire epic. So it's been a few days, I've done a little bit of grinding earlier today, and yeah, my base is a bit different. That is Augian's doing. Uh, he decorated my little pathway this, with this cool new blue fire, which is very epic. I think he did something with the farm. He also left me really a lot of iron. Which is very good so yeah thanks to him a shout out a uh, link in description yeah he's a fellow Taz crafter although at this point he's more well known for his roblox streams but yeah you can go check him out he also got me uh i think a bit of netherite scrap which is really nice but speaking of netherite boom yeah i decide to uh do my little tnt mining at y10 instead of y20 and there's way less lava, which meant with the same amount of TNT, I found like three times as more than I did at like, you know, the start or the first time I tried that. So that's very good. I also got the little piece of nether or piece of ancient debris that was just kind of sitting there in plain sight and I forgot to get it. <laughs> yeah, that. I got some good enchanted stuff. Of course, I'm not all done on netherite. I still need to get my sword. And I still need to get, like, my chest plate. Although, I'm, like, probably am never going to use that. Or rarely going to. So, it's not a huge deal. But, yeah, that's that's kind of what's been going on. If you liked the video, uh, make sure to like and subscribe. I haven't been doing as good on likes recently. Despite doing good on, like, subscribers and views. So, if you could like the video comment something about it that would be really nice very helpful and whoa the, the, okay uh, that scared me a minute uh, yeah like and subscribe uh, if you really like the content you can join the discord server yeah I have a discord it's very cool I'm sure most of you know 
but I figured I'd put that out there. So, yeah, that's kind of going to be it for today's episode. So, yeah, see ya. 2,000 years later.